No way of making friends. The liquid hydrogen tank inside the actual reactor. Get him. You can come and stay with me. You can come and stay with me. T minus one minute. Get him. Take the damn picture. Three main engines are ready to start. Bad light. The booster joint heaters are being deactivated at this time. T minus 48 seconds, and we're transferring to orbiter internal power. Discovery is now running on its uh, three yeah, onboard fuel cells. Yeah, it's not bad. Coming up, want to go for auto sequence start at T minus 31 seconds. Yeah, and we have a go for auto sequence start. Discovery's onboard computers have primary control of all the vehicle's critical functions. 20 seconds. The South Suppression Water System has been activated, protecting Discovery and the launch pad from obstacle energy flows. We have been on Solids turn. That's just amazing. Yeah, that's that's my the you know, the steam blows. <laughs> Discovery's three main engines are burning fuel at a rate that would drain an average swimming pool in about 25 <laughs> seconds. He's a and thirsty girl. Solid rocket boosters produce more than 7 million pounds of thrust. One minute, 50 seconds into the flight, we're standing by for separation of the twin solid rocket boosters. Discovery now traveling 2,695 miles an hour. The altitude, 24 miles. The outrange from the Kennedy Space Center, 29 miles. And Sep. There it is. Booster separation confirmed. 